What is up everyone, this is FNH here with a brand new video talk about how to live stream directly from your Elgato. Yes, so if you don't want to set up through OBS or you don't want to do it through Streamlabs, you can actually live stream directly from your Elgato capture device itself all you need is the elgato capture card uh pro software which comes with when you download it if not i can leave a link in the description below for you guys to check it out obviously set up your elgato device once you have it all set up um there's a lot of things that like you might get confused on like how it starts off so on the right side of your screen under capture there's a few things that are happening one you obviously have your device um in here you can actually fix up your settings on how you want it i obviously i have the nintendo switch um you can have what you're trying to do the hdmi audio you can change the profile what do you want it hd obviously i want hd i want 60 frames per second and i have the best quality because that's what i try to do when i record my videos for my gaming channel i try to go down that route again you can change up all the other different preferences but this is the settings i like and i would recommend you guys to you know give this a shot if you're trying to go for those settings now the next thing is you need to connect your youtube channel i actually have my two youtube channels connected both of my gaming channels one is commentary one is not no commentary and if you click the plus sign i'm not gonna click it because all like the details pop up with the stream key and whatnot it's gonna literally tell you to sign in your youtube account and then it's gonna tell you to click into the youtube account which one you want to stream on once you do that that's it it's literally gonna set up right there and then and all you need to do is fix your title over here on what you want to call it and you should be good to go the mbs i would i keep it at 10 because obviously you want to stream the best quality possible to your viewers so keep it at 10 um over here you can again change your preferences you have your server you have obviously it's public it's gaming um it's obviously it's gaming it could be something else but <laughs> it's gaming uh 1080p and again 60 frames per second that's the settings i go for you can fix the game audio you can like you know play around with this see you know go up or down is it good is it not you can fix your uh this if you're going to live commentate you can fix your live commentary as well like i like over here you can see obviously it's on the wrong microphone it's on my uh, oculus's headphones it should be on the yeti so you change it to the yeti uh this is really good tool to have audio automatically reduced game sound um because that helps like you know your voice will be priority which is how it should be but again if you're not commentating and you're just live streaming like let's say it's a no commentary channel like mine then i would recommend you you know just doing that uh these are if you're trying to make a video and you're trying to like upload it to youtube or save it to your desktop so those aren't too those don't matter too much um if you're going to commentate you click into the commentating button and it'll start recording your so as you can see right now my mic's moving now because it's the same yeti that i'm currently using so now it will uh commentate or take your commentary into consideration now it's not and if you click stream this one i'm not going to <laughs> it'll start live streaming on obs uh, on youtube itself i should say uh they do come with some pre-made templates which is great so you can see you can literally click like uh link in like followers and whatnot uh, i like some of these some are pretty cool uh some get kind of crazy uh like these little ones are good because this one over here you can have your webcam showing up at you um over here like i said you can have your webcam again they do have some pretty cool customized ones i personally just keep it blank um uh, but yeah <laughs> so yeah this is how you live stream from uh directly through the elgato capture cards platform itself without going through obs or Streamlabs and all that other nonsense directly from elgato uh if you guys overall like the video please smash that like button it helps a lot if you're new to the channel make sure to subscribe and click the notification bell on that fnh out peace